The Brady Bunch. My name is Nikki Nicole Clifford. My dad's name is Dan Clifford. Um, he had a stroke about four years ago. Um, he has aphasia and apraxia, so he has trouble speaking and getting his words out. Come on, please. <laughs> With Dan, he knows exactly what he wants to say. He has cognitive capacity to speak, but the link between the brain and the mouth has sort of been broken. I want Dan Black. So we use music to kind of get in the brain and help pull that language out of him um, and over time retrain the brain to learn to speak in a different way than it did before. Good, how are you? Good. I'm Jenny Rook. I'm the executive director of Institute for Therapy Through the Arts. We provide art, drama, dance movement, and music therapies here. Our clients are all ages and individuals who struggle with a variety of issues. I can express myself through art instead of having a one-on-one -on -one, um, direct conversation. It's more collaborative, it's more expressive. My name is Isabella Cordova. I'm here at um, the ITA facility in Evanston. Ever since I was in eighth grade, I have struggled with uh, social anxiety. I couldn't talk to my teachers, I couldn't uh, talk to my classmates. I used to carry like earbuds in my ears like 24-7 because I just did not want anyone to talk to me. So I'm Dr. Marnie Rosen at the Institute for Therapy Through the Arts. I've been here five years. I'm the practice director um, and art therapist. Being able to create my own poster here. Bella, when she first started with me, it was it was all focused on the arts. There was even looking at me saying a single word, even answering a direct question was so much pressure. With Bella today, we just glued things to canvas that were broken and were being recycled and it didn't matter what it looked like. It's about finding a way to get comfortable with oneself, to express oneself, to explore new things. Therapy isn't something that people access the same way, right? Everybody has a different path to healing. I can 100% say I would not be where I am without ther this therapy. Right now I'm at DePaul at their theater, um, at the th their theater program studying theater management. My goal is to be a producer, to have more women in um, positions of power in the entertainment industry. Our clients don't come here because they're musicians or they have a background in theater or dance. I think it surprises them when they realize, I can use music, I can use art, and this is really helping me, and I can actually do some of this on my own after I learn techniques in the therapy session with my therapist. That's the